Unpacking, subpar, dive into its meaning. Hey there, language enthusiasts. Today, we're going to delve deep into an interesting English phrase, subpar. If you've ever wondered what it means or how to use it, stick around because you're in for a treat. Before we jump into its idiomatic usage, let's look at the literal meaning. Subpar can be broken down into two parts, sub and par. Sub is a prefix that means beneath or below, and par is a term often used in sports like golf to describe a standard or average. So when combined, subpar literally means below the standard. While its roots might be in sports, subpar is commonly used in everyday English to describe something that is not as good as expected or below average. Example, the movie was subpar. I expected it to be much better. It can be applied to a variety of situations, from someone's performance at work to the quality of a meal at a restaurant. Understanding a word or phrase's synonyms can often provide more clarity. Here are a few synonyms for subpar, inferior, mediocre, below average, unsatisfactory. So, if you ever want to vary your vocabulary or make sure someone understands subpar, you can use one of these synonyms. And there you have it. The next time you come across the phrase subpar, not only will you know its origins but also how to use it like a pro. Remember, Language is all about understanding and context, and every term has its unique story. We hope this video shed light on the story of subpar for you. Until next time, happy learning!